I'm my daughter, and I have a son, Owen, who is 12. We paint together. He has autism, and we uh, paint our backgrounds to work on his fine motor skills. So, I'm doing something, I suppose, slightly different today. Um, we shall see, as I always say, what happens next. I kind of felt like doing, like, just something like a little more, um, almost abstract with painting today. Um, kind of flowers, but just more, I don't know, just very random. Oops. I'm about to lose some of my paint here. Um, Nothing in particular and no reasons why, but I just felt like some flowers with just like it's kind of a little more abstract and maybe I feel like that's what I've been doing kind of lately is just painting some stuff that's more maybe emotional, not really set in stone. Not that I suppose I do that either, but um, kind of like trees flower trees so far. Now, let's see. I'm going to kind of go back and do a little more So, Owen um he had a pretty good day today. Went to church, um, and we then um, went to lunch with some friends, which was nice. Um, and then we were almost home, and he said he wanted to go fishing. So we went to the lake, and we, um, he sat on the, the, um, shore, the edge of the lake, whatever you want to call it. And he, um, told me that if you, um, if you have a boat, then you can go out on the water and you catch big fish. Otherwise you sit on the Sure, and you catch little fish. I'm sure there's some fishermen that will debate that, but I just loved his his reasoning and what was happening. So I I thought that was very logical to me that we didn't get to go out on the water, so we didn't get a big fish. We didn't get any fish, but the day that we actually catch a fish, I think he would really like it. But I need to take him some more before, and I'm terrible at fishing. Um, <laughs> but we'll get there one day. We'll get there. Okay, so now that we have this, this is what I always do. I want, like, I want something different. Um, and so now let's mix and see what happens. I just, I, 
one day, well, I've done this many times, but one day I painted this rooster and as many times as I kept painting it, it just was not doing what it needed to do. And so then once I painted the rooster, I went back and I just finger painted on top of it. And the more I did it, the more it was completely different. And it ended up being a troll. It was a complete troll. Um, and I like, it's one of my absolutely favorite paintings. And so now when I look at it, what we used to be, what we were before, what we think we are, who we think we are, we can change, we can adapt, we can move, we can manipulate our thought process, our emotions, who we are, what we want to do. And with that, we can change and we can become something completely different. And so I think about that and I think, what can we do or what should we do to really be who we want to be? So my goal is to think about that sometimes. And so, here we are. What should the story become? And maybe everyone will see something different. But if you look hard enough, maybe it's a narwhal. Maybe it's a dream. Maybe it's a cloud. I don't know. But for now, it can be anything we want it to be. <laughs> Maybe. Oops, knocked it. Maybe it's just the ocean becoming the waves. What dreams are made of? And maybe we could change it again. <laughs> but could make it into a mermaid. Sometimes I don't want to like end a painting. Sometimes I just like it really isn't what it's ever supposed to be. Sometimes I overthink too much of what they should be.
So you know what's going to happen now? It's going to become a mermaid. As I knock everything over, I truly need to straighten my paints up here. I'm having like, um, <laughs> they, they have become, um, uh, avalanche. I need to go through them all because I don't have a lot that are um, they are gone, 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 you see. So let's see what happens here. Alexa, stop. And there we go. Hmm. I decided. Sometimes our dream needs to be an even more of a dream. And so... Literally, what lies beneath. Hmm. I sign O for Owen. And then L. And B. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great rest of your day. Toodles, toodles.